Hello students, welcome to Dr. Shorab's classes. So in this particular video, we will be looking into this uh, particular exam of Institute of Actuaries of India, that is the AECT of June 2022. Okay, so we will solve the whole paper and this. So starting with the first section, that is the mathematics sections and this is the question number one. So we will be starting with the mathematics and then we will go into this statistics part and the rest of the part we will cover. So be with us and let us see the problems and we will check how to solve the problems. Okay. So this part is of maths. So now what is the question is saying that let fx be uh, function that is uh, mapping from real space r to r and it is defined by f of x is equal to 5 of x cube plus 9 then we have to find what the function f will be okay so given over here it is 5 x cube plus 9 so let us take that uh, two points uh, x1 and x2 b belongs to this real space r so we have this f of x1 uh, if we write this and this is I will be minus of f of x2 so which is uh, x1 cube minus x2 cube so if we write it it will be in this manner x1 minus x2 x1 square plus x2 square plus x1 x2 this equal to 0 right so if we this equal to 0 so from here we can either it can be taken as that x1 minus x2 is equal to 0 that is we can say that is x1 is equal to x2 or we can say that uh, this x1 square plus x2 square plus x1 x2 this is equal to 0 that is x1 equal to x2 is equal to 0 since this x1 and x2 are both real okay so if we take that x1 equal to x2 then the function x1 equal to x2 then the function f is on 2 right now let us take that it, 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 it is x1 equal to x2 in this case so it is 1 to 1 okay f1 is 1 1 right now if you let us take that let us take this f x uh, 5 of x cube So 5 of x cube plus 9 is equal to y which belongs to the real space r. Then from here how we can write x cube as this is x cube it is y minus 9 by 5 right simple or x is the cube root of y minus 9 by 5. So from here you can see that f is on right so in our option if we check with the options then it is going with the matching with the option d that is the function f is 1 1 and on 2 okay so this solves our question number 1 uh, let's go to the question number 2 so in the question number 2 we have to find the value of this limit x tends to 0 4 plus x to the power half minus 2 by whole by x okay so we have to find the value of this limit so let us write the limit is x is tends to 0 4 plus x half minus 2 by x so if we multiply both the numerator and the denominator by its conjugate so what it will be so we can write this over here as this is 4 plus x to the power half plus 2 by 4 plus x to the power half uh, 
plus 2 okay similarly so we can write this as limit x tends to 0 right so it is that numerator will be 4 plus x minus 4 by it will be x multiplied by 4 plus x to the power half plus 2 right so this will be the expression now if we put the value of this limit in this case so you will find that it is a 0 by 0 form so we know that we have to apply the L hospitals rule over here so applying the L hospital rule okay. so now what will be the expression will we have the limit simplifying to limit x tends to 0 so the numerator would be 1 upon this will be in the denominator it will be 4 plus x to the power half plus of 2 right so if we now uh, this uh, calculate the limit of this so 1 by it will be 2 plus 2 4 1 by 4 so what is the value of the limit so the value of the limit is 1 by 4 so the correct option in our case is option a so the question 3 says that one of the polynomials zeros of the polynomials 2x cube minus uh, plus x square minus 5x plus 2 is 1 find the other zeros okay so we have the given polynomial as this 2x cube plus x square minus 5x plus 2 right and one of the zeros is 1 so we have this x minus 1 x minus 1 is a factor of the given polynomial so it is a factor of the given polynomial right so if we divide this the polynomial by this x minus 1 so it will leave as we will get the quotient as this will be 2x square plus 3x minus 2 okay so then what are the factors of this 2x square plus 3x minus 2 so it will be one of the factor is x plus 2 and another factor is 2x minus 1 so what will be the other two zeros from from here we can get this x is equal to 1 is minus 2 and half so the 2 we can write it 2 zeros of the polynomial it will be 1 will be minus 2 and half so let's check with the option so 1 is minus 2 so our correct option is 3c that is minus 2 and half okay so let's move to the next question now coming to question number 4 so it is saying uh, if 4 log x3 plus 2 log x2 is equal to 2 we have to find the value of x so we have this 4 of log base x3 plus 2 log x is 2 and is equal to 2 so we can write this as log of x 3 to the power 4 plus log x 2 to the power 2 is equal to 2 so it is log x of 81 plus log x of 4 is equal to 2 so we have this log x of 81 multiplied by 4 is equal to 2 right so you can see that it is this is 2 is equal to log of x 324 right so we can write this as 2 log x 18 square or 
2 is equal to 2 of log x 18. So from here you can simply identify what will be x. So x is equal to 18. So the correct uh, option is A for A. Okay. So in this particular video we have to solve the first four problems. So in the next video we will solve the next from we will start from question number five. Okay. So these four questions are quite easy. So let us move forward and see you in the next video.